Are you one of the thousands searching for PEI cottage for sale or PEI waterfront cottages for sale on Google? This is one of the top searches these days and we're going to delve into this in this video. We're going to include what the average cottage sells for, how many active listings we have, and a couple of other things. So if this interests you, be sure to subscribe to the channel, press the little bell symbol beside it, and give the video a thumbs up. The first thing I want to do is define what a cottage is because those terms have become slightly blurred everywhere in Canada. A cottage used to be a simple little home, sometimes constructed over a weekend with friends, a barbecue, and some beer. Today, a cottage can be defined as a year-round house, some ranging into the thousands of square feet. Many of these year-round homes that some people refer to as cottages are in fact built-in cottage subdivisions which are now, and have been over the past few decades, traversing to year-round subdivisions with the help of a homeowners association, the owners within that community. For the purpose of searches, the MLS here on the island is divided into seven distinct zones according to this map. A is the west and G would be the east. So for the purposes of our research, we're going to divide that down on the spreadsheet. Currently island-wide, there's only 45 active cottages here in January of 2022. That is a really low number, but it will pick up as the weather gets better and the grass turns green. So don't worry, things will appear on the market. Just make sure you have that search set up, which I'll talk about at the end. Last year, there was 167 cottages sold from coast to coast, east to west, which averages about 14 cottages per month. Typically in the past, prior to 2016, this number would probably be a lot bigger when we had the inventory. Looking at the spreadsheet, you can see what the average sale prices are based on the regions. It's interesting to see that the second most popular search on Google is PEI waterfront cottages for sale, which is typically a third of our market. According to this spreadsheet, based on 2021 sales stats, it worked out to be about 39% as a median average. How can you make sure you don't miss out on the next hot waterfront or cottage listing? Get your agent or your broker to set up a real-time MLS search so you get that information before anybody else. Thank you very much for watching this video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if this sort of stuff interests you. Press the little bell symbol beside it. Give the video a thumbs up. And if you have any questions about PEI real estate or PEI in general, put them in the comments below.